Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Snow and welcome back to another video. So today I wanted to talk to you guys about Genshin Impact, which is my new favorite game for the past, like, since I've started playing. I think, like, I started playing last month when the game released on PC and phone. Uh, but I've been having a absolute blast. Uh, I haven't really been... Uh, super vocal about it just because there's a lot of like varying opinions as people that have tried it and don't like it but I'm telling you myself that I like this game is the game that I'm non-stop playing I haven't had a, this much fun on like a single player game you know with some multiplayer elements in a very very long time and this game just blew all of my expectations on the water not only is it free but since I played on PC a uh, really cool feature is that it has PC to phone cross save. So when I get off my PC and I'm on my way to work uh, and I'm doing my commute, I can actually log in and get my daily rewards for the day, which is unheard of. I've never seen another game do that. I know that it's probably a couple of games that can do that, but like this is my first experience with that. And that, that is that is next level. That is so sick. Uh, I'm so uh, like surprised that it works so well on my iPhone. I have a, a, an 11MX, uh, 11X Max uh, iPhone, uh, but it's so it, it works so well. Uh, not only is this game free to play, I also believe that you do not need to use uh, any money at all to be able to play all the single player in-game content and beat it and like actually do it. The only things that will probably give you a really hard time are like the later levels of the Spiral Abyss. Like I have gotten super lucky when i tell you super lucky i've always been really lucky with uh, my pulls in these kind of gotcha games i've got d luke gene i've pulled razor i've got a couple official i have a constellation for um sucrose like there's a lot of really cool characters in this game and uh, some of the four stars are really crazy like don't even get me started about razor he's like the coolest character in this game super sick um, but like even with those crazy strong characters and like nice builds, I'm still having a lot of trouble just being able to ascend in the Spiral Abyss. So for people that don't have D Luke and like other characters here, I understand why uh, you are complaining. Like all the free to play players, I myself has spend money, but my motto is if the game like if this was a game that was on a shelf. Would I pay $60 in this instance? Yes, I would pay $60 because I believe that the six single player experience is way better than a lot of the stuff that I've played through recently. And that's saying a lot because I played really good games recently. Um, so I definitely put uh, $5 down for the uh, like weekly, the daily login bonus. You get like, I don't know, 60 Primo Gems, the Blessing of the Moon, I think it's called. I also bought the Battle Pass in order to get all those um things that are adding up at the bottom of the battle pass is super sick and then i paid uh in total i've wasted 64 dollars on the game which i think it's uh it's fine right uh, i will ever pass 100 i think i'm actually done spending money on the game unless uh something really crazy comes out like maybe there's a ridiculous bundle that i just have to get because it like uh makes it super easy to get pre gems and pulling in the game is not really important to me anymore uh like excessively because i already have all the characters i want uh the only character that i didn't get that i really wanted was venti um but like it i don't need him now because i have sucrose and my sucrose is pretty beast but like you know it like if if uh if i wouldn't have had d luke i would have razor to play you know like there is remedies to stuff and there's different kind of builds like we got a free Barbara so like everybody got the healers so I think the game is super fair um obviously like I said I do get very lucky in these kinds of games so I wouldn't uh like if you get some trash pulls at the beginning try resetting you know resetting your account and making another version of your game because a lot of people are doing that just to be able to get like at least one five star character I think that the rates in this game are garbage don't get me started I think the rates in this game are really bad, but I believe that underneath that, the game has a lot of fun, cool things in the world. The, the world is massive. There's a lot of places to go. There's a lot of missions to do. I finished all my story quests. I'm rank uh, AR rank 40 right now, and I'm having a really good time just roaming around. I'm still finding cool stuff. Like just the other day, I went to a, um, an island in the middle of nowhere and I was able to find like a just a quest line that wasn't available to me that wasn't like hinted at 
via anything in the story, which is really cool. I love stumbling across little interesting things like that. That one mission with that old lady that told me to go find some treasure hunters and I go down and there's like three bosses and a ruined guard and a ruined hunter there waiting for me. Like that's the kind of stuff that I have been missing in gaming in the long time. And I think that's because this is a new IP. It's a new version, a new like set of characters for me to, to like, you know, uh, the game is voice acted I at least I, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm like super on this game right now. I, I will be streaming this game for a little bit uh, because the new expansion is going to be coming out on November 11th. So definitely, definitely come through twitch.tv slash snow MLG if you want to check my stats out. But like I'm having way too much fun right now in Genshin. And I don't think I will be quitting anytime soon. Uh, if I do put another like $20 down, it won't be anything super serious. I, uh, I am very like, I, I'm not saying that, I, that I won't be spending a lot of money. Cause I know how people are in this game, but like, I, I take care of myself. I would never put 300, $400 onto this game unless somebody comes on stream and like donates a whole bunch of money, but it wouldn't be straight out of my pocket, you know, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you like what you see, like, comment, subscribe for more. I will be playing Genshin Impact at twitch.tv slash snowmlg every Monday and Tuesday. So please uh, stick around for that and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.